Have you ever wondered if we could actually see like the Terminator with those glowing red eyes scanning for targets? Or maybe have Geordi's visor giving us superhuman vision across the electromagnetic spectrum? Well, buckle up because the future of cybernetic eyes isn't just science fiction anymore, and what's happening in real labs right now might blow your mind. I'm talking about actual bionic eyes that are restoring sight to people who thought they'd never see again. But here's the kicker, we're not just stopping at basic vision. Scientists are pushing the boundaries toward features that would make even Adam Jensen jealous. Today, we're diving deep into the wild world of cybernetic eyes, separating Hollywood fantasy from cutting-edge reality. Let's start with what science fiction promised us. The Terminator's eye could analyze threats, measure distances, and provide tactical information overlaid directly onto vision. Geordi LaForge's visor let him see across the entire electromagnetic spectrum, from infrared to radio waves. And who could forget Adam Jensen's retinal implants with their sleek design and augmented reality capabilities? These fictional devices didn't just restore sight, they enhanced human vision far beyond natural limits. But here's where things get interesting. Real-world cybernetic eyes are already changing lives in ways that seemed impossible just decades ago. The most successful example is the Argus II retinal prosthesis system. This incredible device bypasses damaged photoreceptors in the retina and directly stimulates the remaining retinal cells with electrical pulses. Here's how it works, and this is genuinely fascinating. A tiny camera mounted on special glasses captures images and sends them to a processing unit worn on the body. This processor converts the visual information into electrical signals, which are wirelessly transmitted to an implant surgically placed on the retina. The implant contains an array of electrodes that stimulate retinal cells, creating patterns of light that the brain interprets as vision. Now, before you get too excited thinking we've achieved Terminator-level sight, let's talk reality. The Argus 2 doesn't restore perfect vision. Users typically see patterns of light and dark that help them navigate spaces, recognize large objects, and even read large text. It's not the crystal clear, enhanced vision of science fiction, but for someone who's been blind for years, being able to see the outline of a doorway or recognize when someone is approaching is absolutely life-changing. But scientists aren't stopping there. Research teams worldwide are working on next-generation bionic eyes that could bring us closer to sci-fi capabilities. Some experimental devices are targeting different parts of the visual system. Instead of just stimulating the retina, researchers are exploring direct stimulation of the visual cortex in the brain. This approach could potentially help people with damaged optic nerves or severe retinal damage. The Australian Bionic Eye Project has developed prototypes with higher resolution electrode arrays. More electrodes mean more detailed visual information. While current devices might have 60 electrodes, future versions could have thousands, dramatically improving image quality and detail recognition. Here's where things get really exciting for sci-fi fans. Researchers are actually working on some of those fantasy features we've seen in movies. Zoom capabilities are theoretically possible by digitally magnifying the camera input before sending it to the retinal implant. Imagine being able to zoom in on distant objects just by thinking about it. Thermal imaging integration is another realistic possibility. Since these systems use external cameras, there's no technical reason why infrared sensors couldn't be incorporated. Users could potentially switch between normal vision and thermal imaging, seeing heat signatures just like the Predator. Even augmented reality overlays aren't off the table. The processing unit could theoretically overlay digital information onto the visual field before transmitting to the implant. GPS directions, text translations, or even facial recognition data could appear directly in someone's field of vision. But let's address the elephant in the room, the limitations. Current technology is nowhere near the seamless, high-definition experience shown in movies. The resolution is extremely low compared to natural vision. Colors are often absent or limited. The field of view is restricted. And the learning curve is steep, Users need extensive training to interpret the electrical stimulation as meaningful visual information. There are also surgical risks and the constant need for maintenance. These aren't simple contact lenses you pop in and out. They require serious surgical procedures and ongoing medical support. However, the progress is accelerating rapidly. 
new materials are making implants more biocompatible and longer lasting. Advanced signal processing is improving image quality. Machine learning algorithms are being developed to optimize how visual information is converted into electrical stimulation patterns. Some researchers are even exploring completely different approaches. Optogenetics involves genetically modifying retinal cells to respond to light, potentially eliminating the need for electrode arrays entirely. Stem cell therapies might one day regenerate damaged retinal tissue instead of replacing it with artificial components. The timeline for sci-fi level cybernetic eyes is still uncertain, but the foundation is being built right now. Within the next decade, we'll likely see dramatic improvements in resolution, field of view, and additional features. The first generation of truly enhanced vision, beyond just restoration, might not be far away. What fascinates me most is how this technology could eventually benefit everyone, not just people with vision impairments. Enhanced night vision, zoom capabilities, and augmented reality integration could become as common as smartphones today. So while we're not quite ready to join Starfleet or hunt replicants through future Los Angeles, the gap between science fiction and reality is closing fast. The cybernetic eyes of tomorrow might be even more impressive than anything Hollywood imagined. What features would you want in your cybernetic eyes? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more deep dives into the technology that's reshaping our world. Hit that notification bell so you never miss when science fiction becomes science fact.